Hi everybody. So I've been away for such a while, but um, uh, my makeup has been on hold. But uh, today I was on the Twitter and I noticed that Alex Reed was trending, and I thought, Oh, Alex, what have you done again? Um, he is my absolute favourite cage fighting scally lad, and not only do we all want to be bent over the bonnet of a car by him, but we would love to look just like him. So, here's the top tip to transform an otherwise feminine and soft face like my own into something hard, sensual and rugged. Now, I'm going to start off with an acrylic paint here in um, iridescent bright gold. Now, incidentally, this is the same paint that um, Jodie Marsh uses when she goes um, bodybuilding. So we're just going to go for an all-over coverage to give that sort of nice, shiny Essex sheen that says health, health, health. I'm also going to go for eyebrow coverage because these just won't do when it comes to being Alex Reed. Now, I noticed recently that there seems to be a lot of turmoil in Alex Reed's life. I saw he released an amazing number one hit single, which I listened to over 37 times on YouTube, according to my play count. Um, and then it was withdrawn again, which was devastating. Because I love listening to that. Okay, so as you can see, it's giving me a nice healthy glow. And then today it all kicked off when Chantel started going a bit mad on Twitter. And well, I'll get on to what I think of her. Okay, so that's perfect. Now next I'm going to do is I'm going to try and transform my soft jawline into a thick neck, or you know, that can really support a sexy big head like Alex's. Yeah, so I noticed that Chantel would be mouthing off, and um, well, we all know what I think of her, because personally, I, Katie Price is one of my idols, so when the two of them got together, um, they like gods, it was like um, sort of Mount Olympus was reforming in Romford. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to colour in my neck. So it gives, this is a, a brush just from B&Q. It is a, I think, a two-inch brush. One and a half inch, which I heard is the same size as Alec Ruth's cock. Anyway, and I'm going to draw around the jawline to give me the strong, masculine jaw. This is the same tip that you might have seen before because it's one that Boy George likes to do. As you can see, this is giving me like a really macho jawline. Keep going around the jaw, just wet that a bit more. I'm just using actually my old coffee cup from the morning. I've still got a bit of coffee in, just like steroids to me. Yeah, so when Katie Price and Alex Reed got together, I did think it was heaven was, you know, fulfilled. And then, obviously that wasn't to work out because she's such a strong and powerful woman. And there's not enough for two of them in the relationship. So I thought maybe Chantel, as a second-rate star, would do fine. But obviously it wasn't to be. She couldn't accept the wonderful Roxanne. So, there we go. I think I might go a bit further on, just to give more neck, less chin. God, I might even have to get more, more chin. But, you know, you can experiment with where your chin should be. Alex Reed certainly does. So, oh, there we go. I think that's sort of perfect. Brilliant. Um, now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to accentuate the eyes. Now, you might have noticed that, like Alex, I have beautiful blue eyes. And what we're going to do is we're going to accentuate that, but in a sort of more rugged, masculine way. So I'm going to take a bit of blue, and I'm using face paint here because it's more hard-wearing. And with the finger, I'm going to apply it as you would an eyeshadow. There we go. I'm going to do the other eye as well. Because it's going to be a sort of a mixture of the hard, rugged, black eye side that Chantel would give him, and then the soft, beautiful side of Roxanne coming out. So we're going to go for a very smudged look there. It's, it's like a, a sort of blue eye. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add purple to accentuate around the edge. Now I'm using the Stargazer here, um, neon colour in purple. I'm going to take a little brush, and I'm going to try and paint that just above where I put the blue. Can you see how that's already really bringing out my eyes? And it's giving me that sort of bruised puppy dog effect that Alex Reed does so well. Perfect. Oh yeah, that, that's absolutely wonderful. 
Now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw on a lip line. Now I'm strictly speaking going off the Alex Reed and more into his alter ego Roxanne, who yes, Chantel, it was me who um, texted him asking me to, asking him to sex me dressed up as Roxanne, but who wouldn't? I mean, not only is he a masculine sexual Adonis, but he makes a beautiful woman. So anyway, as Alex Reed does, I just draw on a lip line that I think is suitable. There you go. There. Nothing. I'm doing this in blue as well, just for the bruised effect. And then what we're going to do is just colouring it in. Um, now, any child could do this, but um, Alex does have problems, so don't worry about missing the line a little bit. I'm using a juicy chit chat lipstick from the pound store. And I've actually seen him use this one as well. So you just colour it in. Yeah, as I said, don't worry about the lot missing the lines a little bit because you know that's Alex's charm really going over the lines a bit there we go Ooh. perfect sexual and perfect now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use a little paintbrush and with some finishing touches in this black line finishing off that transforming my face into that sort of much more sensual Alex Reed look so I'm just going to draw a bit more of a furrowed brow. So you just want straight lines through the eyebrow like that, and then a bit furrowed in the middle. Because we know he likes to think a lot. Look, we can frown and then draw them up. Perfect. And I'm also, I think I'll just draw on some, some muscles. So we'll go for, a, you know, some double Ds like Jordan. It must have been amazing when they were going out. The sort of the air cushions of double D on double D. Draw those and then just... Put my nip in. There we go. I might do a bit of top cleave as well. Yeah, that looks good. Because obviously I'm not quite as muscly. I could like contour my muscles a bit like that. But you know, no need to go over the top, guys. So I think uh, there we have it. This is a nice Alex Reed daytime look. And um, obviously he likes to have his hair all sticking up on end. So I might just do a bit of like that. You know, because it's a much more masculine Essex look that I know he likes. Just set my face. And now um, I'm going to go off and um, cage fight. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.